And in this video I want to talk about the sharpness control, specifically on this camera, the Canon EOS R. On a very changeable day in the UK, as is usual with the sun moving in and out of the clouds, so apologies if my exposure is all over the place, I'll do my best to keep on top of it. In most video devices, increasing the sharpness control doesn't give you any more detail. What it actually does is it adds contrast to defined edges in the form of a black or a white outline. And if you've ever tried to chroma key with overly sharpened footage, you'll know how difficult it can be to key out that ugly black or white outline that tends to align along the edges of your subject. The Canon EOS R has received a fair bit of bad press for the softness of its 4K video files. And I've done my own videos comparing it with other cameras that seems to bear that out. But I've been doing some more testing with the Canon EOS R and discovered that it's possible to get much more detailed images straight off the camera than I previously thought. Now, if you've ever tried to calibrate a TV or a monitor using some test patterns, you may be familiar with the sharpness control test pattern. And this test pattern is designed to make it easy to spot any artificial edge enhancement your TV might be applying so you can set the sharpness control correctly. So the idea is to increase the sharpness control until you start to see a black contrasting edge appearing on the white circles and then slowly decrease it until this edge just disappears. Now on some equipment, Lowering the sharpness control below the midpoint simply reduces the amount of sharpening that's applied from its default midpoint. Whereas with others, the central point equals zero sharpening and any setting below that value is actually applying a softening effect and literally smearing fine detail. So what I wanted to do with the EOS R was to point the camera at this test chart and using an HDMI cable connected to a calibrated monitor establish where the sharpness control on the camera needed to be set. With the camera's sharpness control set at zero, the image has no obvious edge enhancement. Increasing it to its highest value, 7, you can clearly see the black outline around the white circle. Reducing it down to 6, to 5, to 4 and then to 3, it reduces in intensity quite significantly. And by 2, I'd say we have a pretty usable image. And this confirms what I'd previously suspected. The midpoint applies too much sharpening, whereas the zero value is softening the image. From my tests, I'd suggest that the best sharpness control setting on the Canon EOS R is either plus 1 or plus 2, not zero and not in the middle. But that's really it for this video. Please leave your comments down below. Um, don't forget to like and subscribe if you want to see more videos from this channel. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.